Yo, what's good, YouTube? This is All Out Apparel. I know it's been a while, but I've been busy with other things. Anyways, I have a tan MCM backpack. Um, the color is a little off on it, to be honest, but it's still, like, thick and heavy. Zippers still work good. Um, still a good backpack for 60 bucks. You know, the, re the retails are, like, 800 you know, to a thousand so can't go wrong with the price either way it's good it's heavy um inside got the tag mcm uh it has mcm print all over i don't know if you can see let's see, let's see. you can see a little Cup holders on the side. Um, it comes flattened, so you gotta like stuff it probably inside. Sorry if these reviews aren't, you know, too good. It's just a quick review to kind of give you a, a glimpse, an idea of what you get. These aren't like detail reviews if you want a detail review you just let me know and i'll take my time out and review one single item studs comes with a free mcm keychain which is pretty cool it's pretty this is pretty good quality actually it's pretty cool you wear it on your belt or something all right i got two of them but these are for somebody. MCM box. They never get this right. I don't know what they do. It's probably... It just always looks fucked up. It's not the correct box. Um, not the correct dust bag. This is like, I think, $38. It's still in plastic. I just got this package. Literally, the, the post office just dropped it off. You got the gold, gold MCM buckle. MCM, which is correct. The color is correct for the most part. Everything looks pretty clean. Um, I believe it's reversible. I'm pretty sure you can reverse it to black if you want. But yeah, it's pretty good. This is a good belt. The belt itself is good, you know. Alright. LV belt. Box. They didn't give me an LV box this time. They must have been out or something. Just a brown box. Oh no, it's not LV. It's not LV. That's why. This is always. This is the nineteen dollar replica AAA. Always comes with these shitty bags, but you're paying for the belt. You know, they don't even have to give you a box. So for nineteen dollars, you get a belt and box and dust bag. That's pretty good. Why so? The buckle's decent size, if you could tell by my hand. You know, it's about the size of my fingers. It's probably, I'd say, four inches by three inches. Red versus the black. Like I said, in, any in-depth reviews you want, just let me know. Because, I'm, you know, this is just to show you, what, like, what you get. This is another YSL. Same thing. I think this is blue. No, brown. With the gold buckle. Let me see, let me see. Brown with the gold. Same thing, same thing. Hermes. 
this is all still wrapped. I'm sorry, but you know, it just got here. I'm trying to do this quick. Brown Hermes. You see, I might switch this buckle with the red belt. Fuck it. That's a good box. I mean, like, quality-wise, it's not the right box. I'll show you the right Look, I got an authentic one, which is quadruple-A, and then I got a triple-A. That is the correct box. These belts are amazing. I'm going to do a separate review for these, for this, so I can get into depth. This belt is amazing. I got the wrap. This is the triple-A. Little. That's how it should be. Like I said, I'm going to do a separate review for this. Shopping bag for it. Polos. I guess I'll uh, do, I'll show one. I'll do the Spain. It's all stitched, you know. It's all stitched. This is first hand, so I didn't cut none of the threads, so you can see everything's looking pretty solid, though. Always go two sizes up on this. Well, it depends. If you're real petite and like skinny and slim, probably one size. But if you're like husky or you know decently big, or you know what I'm saying, go up two sizes just to be comfortable. An XXL is going to fit like a large to a medium. But yeah, it's pretty it's pretty solid. The quality of it is pretty thick. Um, smells fine. It's a little wrinkly. Just a patch on one side. It says Spain. Patch on the other side. Um, these don't have the the breath hole, the breather holes under the armpit. I got some before that did. I guess it doesn't matter. Eight on the back. It's pretty good. It's only well, they're twenty. They were sixteen dollars, but um. I guess they decided to raise their price to 20 I don't know why. I guess I mean, that was cheap. $16 is pretty cheap for a freaking polo shirt. That is pretty spot on. Like, no one's going to call you out on that shit. I promise you. That shit, it looks good. Cartiers. This shit, look, this shit is impressive. The box looks correct to me. These I opened already because I was curious. And they're nice. Buffies, Cartiers, whatever. You get what I'm trying to do. It says Cartier. Cazals, I didn't open, so they're just black. I don't feel like opening all that. Another pair of Cazal. So these are, I was curious about these two. These are nice. Two tone brown. Look authentic, I'm telling you. Heavy. Says Cazal right there. Box is nice, correct. 
pair of Versace glasses that I've shown plenty of times, and another Hermes boat, nothing serious, but yeah, man, that's my review, please, you know, like, subscribe, um, I'm still doing that giveaway, I think I said 100 subscribers, follow me on Instagram, um, this is all from picksky.com, or picksky.ru, which is, you know, P-I-C-K-Y dot R-U. I'll put the um link in the description. Sorry, I freaking spaced out. Um, but yeah, man, that's everything. If you want to see anything in depth in depth review, just let me know. I'm gonna do a separate review for the Hermes boat. You know, just because um it's nice and I want to just show that by itself. But yeah, man, subscribe, comment, let me know what you want to see, anything like that. I'm out.